3D printers are the most common and imperative devices that we rely on to bring creative ideas to life. Whether you're a hobbyist, a professional designer, or someone exploring the realms of innovative technology, 3D printers have become an indispensable tool for turning digital concepts into tangible objects. But have you ever stopped and thought about how these remarkable machines actually work? While it is for those tech enthusiasts out there, this is definitely something that will pique your curiosity. In this captivating video, we will take you on an enlightening journey to uncover the mysteries behind 3D printers and explore the intricate details of how they operate, from the input of digital designs to the output of physical objects. By delving into the basics, we aim to provide you with a comprehensive understanding of their functionality and ignite your passion for the fascinating world of 3D printing. Let's start with the basics. The mesmerizing journey of transforming a digital design into a physical object using a 3D printer starts with a digital model. But in the world of 3D printing, it's not just about plain text documents or images. It's about creating a three-dimensional model using computer-aided design CAD, software. This digital model acts as the blueprint for the actual physical creation. Once you've perfected your digital masterpiece, the next step is to prepare it for 3D printing. This involves slicing software that breaks down 3D models into thin layers, just like slicing a loaf of bread. These layers, often referred to as slices or layers of the model, form the foundation for the 3D printer to build the final object. Process of 3D Printer 3D printing can be divided into three key steps, slicing, transfer, and printing. Firstly, slicing software takes your 3D model and divides it into thin layers, typically measured in microns. Each layer represents a cross-section of the object and instructs the printer to construct it layer by layer. Once the model is sliced, the digital data is transferred to the 3D printer. This transfer can be achieved through wired connections, USB, or even wirelessly, depending on the printer's capabilities. The printer then stores this data in its internal memory, preparing to bring your creation to life. The last one is printing, which lets the magic unfold. Rather than relying on ink on paper like traditional printers, 3D printers construct objects by building them layer by layer. This innovative process preserves the original meaning and enhances the writing quality, ensuring better word choice, structure, readability, and eloquence. Instead, 3D printers add material layer upon layer to form a physical three-dimensional object. The choice of materials is vast, ranging from plastics and metals to ceramics and even edible substances in the case of food 3D printers. When it comes to 3D printing, there are different technologies to bring objects to life. Each of these technologies, like fused deposition modeling, stereolithography, selective laser sintering, and polyjet printing, has its own unique approach. FDM is one of the most common 3D printing methods. It works by heating and extruding a thermoplastic filament layer by layer. The melted plastic quickly solidifies, creating a solid structure. SLA, on the other hand, uses a liquid resin that hardens when exposed to ultraviolet light. The object is gradually lifted from the resin tank, and a laser or light source solidifies the resin layer by layer. In SLS, a laser is used to sinter powdered materials like nylon or metal layer by layer. The unsintered powder provides support during the printing process. Lastly, polyjet technology involves jetting layers of liquid photopolymer onto a build tray. Each layer is cured with UV light, while the support material is jetted and cured. This allows for the creation of objects with multiple materials and colors. Components of 3D Printer Regardless of the specific 3D printing technique, every 3D printer comprises fundamental components that collaborate to generate the result. With that said, let us explore the various constituent parts of a 3D printer and delve into their respective functionalities. Print Bed Instead of traditional paper, 3D printers utilize a specialized print bed where the object is meticulously constructed layer by layer. The print bed's surface texture and temperature play pivotal roles in ensuring the optimal adhesion of the printing material, thereby ensuring the precise and flawless creation of the desired object. Extruder Slash Nozzle In fused deposition modeling 3D printers, the extruder plays a vital role in printing. It serves as the housing for the filament, where it is heated and melted to be extruded layer by layer. The nozzle, a critical component within the extruder, controls the size of the material deposition, directly impacting the print resolution. With its precise control and intricate mechanism, the extruder ensures the accurate and high-quality creation of 3D prints, 
making it an indispensable part of the FDM printing technology. Resin Tank The resin tank plays a crucial role for SLA printers as it holds the liquid resin, which serves as the raw material for creating 3D objects. As the printing process begins, the platform slowly lifts the object from the tank, meticulously allowing the resin to solidify layer by layer. This gradual solidification ensures the precise formation of intricate details and complex geometries, resulting in high-quality prints with exceptional accuracy. Control Panel Similar to traditional printers, 3D printers have a control panel that allows users to adjust various settings conveniently. These settings include print speed, layer thickness, and temperature, which can be fine-tuned to achieve the desired printing results. Moreover, some advanced models offer touchscreen interfaces, enhancing the user experience with intuitive controls and a seamless printing process. Filament slash resin cartridges. For FDM and SLA printers, filament or resin cartridges are used to contain the material utilized for printing. These cartridges, which are easily replaceable, provide users with the flexibility to seamlessly switch between different materials or colors based on their specific printing needs and preferences. This convenience empowers users to explore various possibilities and achieve their desired outcomes easily and efficiently. Build Chamber 3D printers come with enclosed build chambers designed to create a controlled environment for printing. This feature helps regulate temperature, humidity, and airflow, reducing the impact of external influences on the printing process. It is especially beneficial for materials sensitive to environmental factors, ensuring optimal printing conditions and improving the quality of printed objects. So here's how a 3D printer works in a nutshell. While the process may seem simple, there are many intricate components that work together to create a 3D printed object. Hope you have found this video to be informative and interesting. If you do, then please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more such content. So, the next time you hit print, remember the complex process that goes into making it happen.